Okay, public comment. Is this general public comment? Yes, sir. All right. Go ahead. All right. Hey, is it right behind Lane good? I don't know what's math. Before you get started, sir. Yes? You're, you're Levi Trumbull. Correct? I am Levi Trumbull. Yes, sir. And you're from Frederick County. I am from Frederick County, Maryland. Which means you're a non-resident and a non-taxpayer. Absolutely. That is okay. exactly what that means, but I do pay federal taxes. Marie, well, do you want to... Let me, let me finish, sir. Okay. We, we, have a, we do have a public participation policy in our township that, okay. that is on our website. Okay. It's been here for over 10 years, mm -hmm. and it, it states in the public, in this, that that we can not allow tax non-taxpayers or non-residents if we choose to. And it's been upheld in court when I've talked to our solicitor to verify that. But if you would like to speak, I'm gonna let you know, go ahead. I've read your comments on the internet, but you know, you, calling us corrupt, so I'm sure you're gonna say more of the same, which is fine. But did I say that? Uh, your headline says corrupt township, yes. Well, okay, well that would be an opinion, so that's number one. And anybody who anybody who tries to silence the First Amendment freedom of speech, I would say that that's pretty corrupt. Um, and I think most people who respected the Constitution would ab absolutely come to that same finding. So okay. I think your, your statements are a little bit preliminary. And I just want to state for the record that there's a lot of other things that I would rather come here tonight and talk about maybe your budget, uh, maybe some infrastructure, the roads I'm hearing is a big issue here. Um, but unfortunately, um, it's the same old issue. And because of Huntington Township Watch, people like myself and people from outside this community get to see what is going on right here inside this building. So my, the gentleman to the far end there, earlier you said that there was some altered clips. Now I wanna be I want to set the record straight. I am not here for every meeting. I don't know what happens here every meeting. I cannot tell you what was altered or edited. I don't know. But all I'll say is that I've never known Huntington Township Watch to alter clips. When I go to their YouTube page, because I do subscribe to them, and what I see is long format videos of these meetings. And I want to be clear, I condemn any threats you said earlier that you've received, or this township has received. Did. The township did. The township received yes. some threat. I condemn that totally. That's not okay. And we want to talk about the First Amendment, uh, Mr. Boyer. That is not protected speech. Death threats, things of that nature, not okay. I don't know who's doing that, but they're not doing that on the behest, or behest of me or anybody else that I know. So I condemn that totally. But I want to give a background here as to why people feel very strongly about the issue. So you came out with a resolution, and the resolution was totally out of line. It was in complete opposition to the First Amendment to the United States Constitution, totally out of line. You had to re essentially kill half of the bill, and then you put forth this amended resolution that is still very gray. And um, I want to talk about reasonableness and obstruction. The cameras that are right here are reasonable. The camera that sits in front of that table right there is also reasonable, and it's not facing you guys, it's facing the audience this way, and the reason that that microphone is there is because you guys don't speak loud enough for people in the back to hear you. The people who watch the videos online later can get a very clear understanding of what's being said here because of that microphone, so it's very important. Um, now, Mr. Wayne here, he's, he's moved it, he's backed off, you know, he can do whatever he wants to do, but from a legal standpoint, it is reasonable to put that camera there. Key word tonight, or key words, I should say, are obstruction and reasonable. It is reasonable to put that camera there, it is reasonable put, to put this camera here, because they are not obstructing anything. You can walk through, there was, I was here the one day with 50, 60 people, or some odd people in this building, and people walked back and forth just fine with that camera right there by that table. And so it, it's, it's not obstructing, and it is reasonable, and a court is definitely going to find that. Uh, Huntington Township Watch, great YouTube channel. I'm sure a lot of people in here follow it, know exactly what I'm talking about. They're doing a great service for this community, no question about that. And I want to talk a little bit about the relationship between media and government. These are journalists right here. Journalists. You guys are the government. You're public figures. You're elected to do what you do. That's all well and fine. What I see a lot of is a lot of friction between media and government. And that's okay, but where it crosses the line 
is when you start getting to this area of trying to control how the media conducts their business. If Huntington Township told you guys how to you know, run your meeting tonight, you'd say you're out of line. And they would be out of line if they tried to do that. You're trying to do vice versa and tell the media how to be media. You can't do it, my friend. So I don't know anything about litigation. As a matter of fact, I don't know if there will be litigation. It's three minutes. Right? It's, three minutes. It's, actually, it's actually, the policy says five for this, this section, but you have one minute left. Three minutes? Well, first of all, there's no timer. Can we get a timer in here? Uh, yeah, I have a timer. I have a timer. You started it? Yeah, I started yeah. it. Okay, well, you should. Well, I didn't know that. You see, somebody should have told me you, well, you, ought, to read, you ought to read the policy. Sir. Uh, yeah. uh, hold a minute. You ought, you ought to read the Constitution. Um, uh, is that in here? Where is that in here? I don't see. Point that out to me somewhere. Public, I just see public comment. I must have a different one than you. It just says public comment. Not looking at the reminder, public comment limited three minutes per person. You cost this is that all enough? Matters. And taxpayers enough. Enough's enough. Okay, well, I'll just say I think we need to bring the temperature down in Huntington Township. All right? That's all I'm going to say. I'm going to leave it at that. What these guys are doing is totally legal with um, recording, whether they put a camera here, whether they put a camera there. Uh, it's a public building, and it's public photography, and uh, and for the record, I still don't see on this form where it says five minutes or three minutes or whatever it says. Thank you, guys. What's that? It's on the front page, right there in bold letters. Okay. Reminder. Okay, Jeff. That's true, but that, this is well, three we're minutes. We're not on that. We're on this public comment. comment. It says three sir, minutes. Sir, he, said public that, he said that that we're was the policy that they were following. He said five minutes. You know minutes. what? I pay taxes here. If I want to bitch and complain about somebody taking up my time, right. then I will. Okay, gentlemen, please. Okay, All right, let's, thank you. Let's calm down. <laughs> I pay taxes, too. Trust me. I'll, I'll bring my taxes. Sir. I pay a lot of taxes, just for the record. Go back to Frederick, then. I, I will go back to Frederick. Right, right after tonight. I'm going back to Fred, to the city of Frederick. Okay, again. Hey, they're doing a good thing. I don't know what the problem is. Think that. Well, the good thing is they're recording these meetings for the people who aren't attending. It's a good sir. thing. Okay, we, we, we're done. You're welcome. Hey, sir, it can get a lot worse. Trust me when I tell you. What? We, Okay, oh, I have a don't press quick question from the press if you don't mind. Scott Scott Pitzer. Oh, this yeah, is the official Scott press. For time. The official oh. press. I beg your pardon? You're the official press? Yes. Okay. I have a question, please. Um, 